Hi, today I'm making biscotti and this was a special request from um, someone who left a comment in one of my previous videos. So I'm super excited because this is my very first request and this biscotti recipe is really healthy because it doesn't have any refined sugar or oil in it. It is made with whole plant food and it has date sugar for a sweetener. So let's get started. The ingredients you'll need are almond flour, date sugar, corn starch or arrowroot powder, baking powder, salt, vanilla, and this is optional but I used sliced raw almonds. You can also add things like unsweetened coconut, raisins, unsweetened dried fruit, or whatever else you'd like. Before you start, you want to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. So first you're going to get a large bowl and you're going to add one and three quarter cups almond flour. Next, you're gonna add one third cup of date sugar. Then you're gonna add two tablespoons of cornstarch or arrowroot powder. Next, add one teaspoon of baking powder. You're also gonna add one quarter teaspoon of salt. If you want your recipe to be SOS free or salt oil sugar free, you can omit the salt. Now mix to combine. Next, you're gonna add three tablespoons of water along with one teaspoon of vanilla. Now mix to combine. Now add your raw sliced almonds and mix. Now dump your mixture onto a parchment paper lined baking pan and form into a rectangle. Your rectangle should be about eight inches wide by three and a half inches high, and the thickness should be about three quarters of an inch thick. You're gonna bake your dough for 20 to 23 minutes. And I started out with 20 minutes and I ended up adding an extra two minutes. So 22 minutes later, I take my dough out and I want to let it cool completely. And after it cools completely, I wanna put it in the fridge for at least one hour so it's one hour later and I transfer my dough onto the cutting board and I use the parchment paper to lift it. And I set my oven to preheat at 250 degrees. It's gonna be a very low temperature. I slide my dough off of the parchment paper and I place the parchment paper back on the baking pan. Now I'm gonna slice my dough with a very sharp knife and I'm gonna slice it on a diagonal and each piece will be about three quarters of an inch wide. Because the log was chilled for an hour, this allows for perfect slices and minimum crumbs. Now I'm going to place my slices with the cut side facing down onto my parchment paper lined baking sheet. I'm going to bake at 250 degrees for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, I take my biscotti out and I'm going to flip to the other side. I'm using tongs, but you actually want to use a spatula for this um, because your biscotti is not yet firm. So you want to be very careful and gentle with it when you're flipping it. So now I'm putting it back into the oven and I'm going to bake it for another 20 minutes on the other side. 20 minutes later, I check on my biscotti and I actually put it back into the oven and I turn off the temperature on the oven and I set my timer for 90 minutes. I'm going to let my biscotti sit in the oven with no heat so that they can further dry out. It's 90 minutes later and here's my finished product, my yummy biscotti. Thank you so much for watching and happy plant eating.